Good day! In this video, we are looking at question 2B of the 2022 NCA Level 2 Formula Team Matters question. Without further ado, let's read the question. M Mia, Maya and Joe want to go on a holiday near a swimmable river in New Zealand. They find this summary table of popular river sites in the North and South Island that are monitored regularly to check if they are swimmable. So the table 2 now we have the roads of safe for swimming, unsafe for swimming and they divide into North Island and South Island. So in the question like this, the first thing you do, you're going to find the total, the row total and the column total. We have found that. So 105 plus 65 is 170, 74 plus 34 is 108 and you add these two numbers, so they are all together 278 rivers. Or in the North Island, you can add these two numbers, it's 179 rivers in the North Island and 99 rivers in the South Island. So what is the probability that a river chosen at random from this monitored site is safe for swimming? So you look at safe now, we are looking at safe, okay? So safe, the total, they are all together. So probability that is safe for swimming is going to be a total of 170 out of the total river 278. Again, you are not make, making any comparison, so you do not need to convert to decimal if you don't want to. So if you can get on that right, you get another easy achieve in this paper. Okay, let's look at part two of this paper. Part two sounds like this. Okay, the table is the same. We just reproduce it from the previous question. And we have done the row total as well as column total and the overall total which is 278 rivers in New Zealand. Okay, then now let's read the question. Mia looks at the data and says, It is more than twice as likely for a river in the North Island to be unsafe for swimming compared to the South Island River. Joe says, It's only 20% more likely for a North Island River to be unsafe for swimming compared to the South Island River. Explain each other's reasoning and decide if either reasoning is supported mathematically. Use relevant calculation to solve this. Okay, so we need to calculate what is the probability that it is unsafe for swimming if it is in North Island River. So to do that, it's very simple. To be unsafe for swimming, we look at this column now, at this row now, I mean. So unsafe will be 100 and unsafe is going to be if we are talking about North Island now, so it's going to be 74 out of 179 because in North Island, 74 and unsafe out of unsafe is 74 out of the total river is 179. This time you are going comparing the proportion, so we are going to put in decimal and that is going to be 0 0.4134. Similarly, what is the probability that it is unsafe for swimming in South Island? So we're looking at South Island now, okay? So unsafe for swimming is going to be 34 out of 99. So 34 out of 99, and you convert them into percent uh, into decimal, it's going to be 0 0.3434. How do Joe get the 20%? It's very simple. He used relative rate. To get the relative rate, he just take this number, 0 0.4134 divided by 0 0.3434, he comes up to 1.204. That is 20% more than what is mentioned in the question. So he, Joe says only 20% more likely, so that is how he get 1.204. That is Joe's reasoning that 20%. So now the next question, how does Maya get his double the amount? He just looking at the relative number. So it's 74 compared to 34. So he just said that the total is more than double, which is not right in statistics because you are looking at proportion rather than the actual numbers. So that is how you answer this question. If you can answer both of them, you should be able to get an excellence for this paper. And I'll see you for question three in the next video. Cheers everyone and have a good day.